Express Card is an interface to allow peripheral devices to be connected to a computer, usually a laptop computer. Formerly called New Card, the Express Card standard specifies the design of slots built into the computer and of cards which can be inserted into Express Card slots. The cards contain electronic circuitry and connectors to which external devices can be connected. The Express Card standard replaces the PC card standards. Hardware that may be plugged into a computer via an Express Card includes Connect cards, i.e. EE 1394B2002, USB 2.0, USB 3.0, Ethernet, serial ATA external stick drives, solid state drives, external enclosures for desktop size PCI Express graphics cards, wireless network interface cards. TV tuner cards, common access card readers, and sound cards. Standards, originally developed by the Personal Computer Memory Card International Association, the Express Card standard is maintained by the USB Implementers Forum. The host device supports PCI Express, USB 2.0, and USB 3.0 connectivity through the Express Card slot. Cards can be designed to use any of these modes. The cards are hot pluggable. The Express Card standard is an open standard by ITUT definition, and can be obtained from the USBIF website free of charge. USBIF administers the Express Card compliance program, under which companies earn the right to obtain a license to use the Express Card logo on their compliant products. Form factors The Express Card standard specifies two form factors. Express card slash 34 and Express card slash 54 a euro the connector is the same on both. Standard cards are 75 mm long and 5 mm thick, but may be thicker on sections that extend outside the standard form for antennas, sockets, etc. The 34 mm slot accepts only 34 mm cards. The 54 mm slot accepts both 34 mm and 54 mm cards. A diagonal guide in the rear of the 54mm slot guides 34mm cards to the connector. Adapters are available for connecting an Express Card slash 34 card to a card bus slot via internal USB 2.0 bus only. Comparison to other standards. The older PC cards came in 16-bit and the later 32-bit card bus designs. The major benefit of the Express Card over the PC card is more bandwidth due to the Express Card's direct connection to the system bus over a PCI Express A, one lane and USB 2.0, while card bus cards only interface with PCI. The Express Card has a maximum throughput of 2.5 Mbit S through PCI Express and 480 Mbit S through USB 2.0 dedicated for each slot, while all card bus and PCI devices connected to a computer usually share a total 1.06 Gbit S bandwidth. The Express Card standard specifies voltages of either 1.5 AV or 3.3 AV. Card bus slots can use 3.3 AV or 5.0 AV. The Express Card FAQ claims lower cost, better scalability, and better integration with motherboard chipset technology than card bus. PCMCIA devices can be connected to an Express Card slot via an adapter. When the PC card was introduced, the only other way to connect peripherals to a laptop computer was via RS-232 and parallel ports of limited performance, so it was widely adopted for many peripherals. More recently, virtually all laptop equipment has 480 Mbit S high-speed USB 2.0 ports, and most types of peripheral which formerly used a PC card connection are available for USB or are built in, making the Express card less necessary than the PC card was in its day. Some laptop computers do not have an Express card slot. Availability An Express card slot had been commonly included on high end laptops made since 2006. Hewlett Packard began shipping systems with Express card in November 2004. Lenovo integrated the slot into their flagship ThinkPad T43 in May 2005. Dell Computer also incorporates this in their Precision, Inspiron, Latitude, Studio, Vostro and XPS laptop product lines. Fujitsu Siemens began shipping systems with Express Card in mid-2005. 
Apple Incorporated included single express card slash 34 slots in every MacBook Pro notebook computer from January 2006 through June 2009. At the June 8, 2009 Apple Worldwide Developers Conference the company announced that the 15-inch and 13-inch MacBook Pro models would replace the Express Card slot with a secure digital card slot, while retaining the Express Card slot on the 17-inch model. In June 2012 Apple discontinued the 17-inch model and no further MacBooks have offered an Express Card slot. ASUS has also replaced the PC Card slot with an Express Card slot on many of its new models. Sony also began shipping systems with Express Card with its new laptop VGNC, VGNSZ, VGNNS, VPC and FW product line. The Acer Aspire laptop series also has a single Express Card slash 54 slot on most new models. Panasonic incorporates Express Card slash 54 slots in all the fully rugged and semi-rugged models of their Torbook brand of laptop computers. Gateway Notebooks also ship with Express Card slash 54 interfaces. Eurocom Notebooks Panther 3.0, Panther 2.0 currently ship with Express Card slash 34 while the Leopard 2.0 ships with Express Card 54. Older models such as the Panther, Leopard, Excalibur, Montebello also supported Express Card interfaces. Overham integrates an Express Card slot in its Mirage 7283 and 9570 laptops. Because of the lack of backward compatibility, some laptop manufacturers initially released models incorporating both card bus and Express Card slots. These included certain models of Acer Aspire, Acer Extensor, Toshiba Satellite, Dell Latitude and Precision, MSIS 42X and Lenovo ThinkPad Z60M, R52. T60, R61 and T61. In March 2005, the Personal Computer Memory Card International Association showed some of the first Express Card products at the CE Bit Trade Show in Germany. A large number of Express Card devices were presented. In November 2006, Belkin announced that it was launching the first Express Card docking station which uses the PCIe part of an Express Card connection to enable 1600x1200 video and the USB part to provide USB, audio and network ports. This points to the ability for Express Card to allow more capable non-OEM docking stations for laptop computers. In 2007, Sony introduced its Vio TZ model, which incorporates Express Cards. Also the Sony Vio FZ and Vio Z series have the Express Card slash 34 slot integrated in them. Sony also uses the Express Card slash 34 form factor for the flash memory modules in its XDCA MXSXS based camcorders, making the copying of video data between these cameras and Express Card equipped laptops easier. For this reason, Sony also offers a USB based SXS reader for desktop computers. The new Toshiba Satellite P and X200-205 series of laptops and desktop replacements have an Express Card slash 34 slot since April 2007. In P200 series it's a slash 54 size not slash 34. Perhaps in other models too, also, previous citation needed irrelevant here, as P840 not part of the P200 slash 205 series. Ever since PCMCIA disbanded in 2009, newer laptops from 2010 on more commonly do not include Express Card slots except for some business-oriented models. For WWAN connectivity cards either mini PCIe slots or USB connected variants have become the preferred connection methods. Express Card 2.0 the Express Card 2.0 standard was introduced on March 4, 2009 at CEBIT in Hanover. It provides a single PCIe 1.0 2.5-bit S-Lane and a USB 3.0 super speed link with a raw transfer speed of 5-bit S. It is forward and backward compatible with earlier Express Card modules and slots. Express Card 2.0 products were expected to be in the market by late 2010. It's unknown at this point whether this standard is taking off in the marketplace. USB 3.0 super speed compatibility is achieved by sharing the pins with the PCIe link. An inserted card signals which mode should be used. 
See also, list of device bandwidths, references. External links, about Express Card Technology, Express Card Technology from PCMCIA at the Wayback Machine, openouts.org, PCI Express Card and PCI Express Mini Card Connector Pinout, HTTP, www.itproportal.com 04 Express Card Format Be Discontinued Slash